What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. This is not reading. This is an informational session on child grooming, if anybody is interested. I just did one on trauma bonding and Stockholm Syndrome, and this one is on child grooming. Um, so we're going to do it. It is off of dictionary.com via Google definition. Child grooming is befriending and establishing an emotional connection with the minor and sometimes the child's family to lower the child's inhibitions and the objective of se sexual abuse. So basically, they're to lower the child's guards. It establishes the um, connection with the minor and sometimes the family to lower the child's guards, and but the purpose is sexual abuse down the line, which is sick. That's sick, 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 sick in the head. What are the signs of grooming a child? Targeting specific kids for special attention, gifts, or activities. Slowly isolating a kid from family members and friends, physically and emotionally. Undermining relationships with parents and friends to show that no one understands you like I do. Gradually pushing or crossing physical boundaries. What are the five stages of grooming? The five stages of grooming, radicalizing children, Stage one, identifying the victim. Stage two, gathering information. Stage three, identifying and exploiting needs. Stage four, desensitization. Say that five times fast. Desensitization, which basically means desensitizing them. So lowering their inhibitions. Basically, Exposing them to abuse and exposing them to abuse like it's okay, but it's not okay. Stage five, initiate abuse. The expert testified that grooming includes such behaviors such as showing a child extra attention, complimenting them, giving gifts, making promises, and increasing contact. Behaviors that may seem innocent to the lay person. What are the seven steps of grooming? Already went over those. Oh, no, I didn't. Identifying and targeting the victim. Any child or teen may be a potential victim. Gaining trust and access. Playing a role in the child's life. Isolating the child. Creating secrecy around the relationship. Initiating sexual contact. Controlling the relationship. Grooming is a form of abuse that involves manipulating someone until they're isolated, dependent, and more vulnerable to exploitation. Grooming is a process during which a child sexual offender draws a child in by gaining his or her trust in order to sexually abuse the child and maintain secrecy. The offender may also groom the parents by persuading them of his or her trustworthiness with children. Very predatorial behavior. Very predatorial. Is gro child grooming a crime? Grooming is an offense. If you suspect a person is being groomed, even if you're not sure, please tell someone. If you think you're being groomed, you should tell someone. So grooming is a crime. Child grooming is a crime. Okay, yeah, I think I went through everything. That's really sick. It's really, really, really freaking sick, man. All right, I love you guys. I hope this helped, and I'm going to stay.